Hey everyone, I hope everyone's doing okay. I'm doing okay for the time being, so I don't know how, how long that's going to last, so I'm going to try and make a quick video while I'm at least feeling halfway human. Just wanted to say what's up, and I don't have anything really important to just kind of wanted to shoot the shit. Uh, I've been getting a lot of messages on Instagram and Facebook and someplace else asking me a bunch of questions about why I don't do any more of my of my um, uh, funny ration review videos. Well, it comes down to uh, they cost a hell of a lot of money, and I don't have the money to spend to buy them. Um, there's a lot of them. There's a lot that I really want to try, but I just, again, I don't have the money to to uh, obtain them. And so it's kind of a, a circle so I don't have the money, so then I can't make a video about it, so then I get sad, and, but, whatever, uh, my health isn't, isn't good, my legs are in absolute agony 99% of the day, and it's wearing me out tremendously, I feel like every day, is about a week's worth of time because it passes so slowly for me and uh, it sucks because besides having the pain and you know having no luck to control it I also have severe insomnia and so if if I can get about Mm, four or five hours of sleep a night, that's pretty damn good. I'm pretty impressed if I can get five hours of sleep a night. Um, most, most nights I stay up for at least four or five hours when others are sleeping. So even now I am exhausted and I really want to go take a nap. But anyways, so I'm shooting this video on my cell phone, and so I don't have my other camera anymore that used to shoot videos. I had to sell it because something had come up and I needed money for, for that something, so I had to sell the camera. So I really can't do any more reviews or, you know, any type of videos because I don't have the proper camera equipment anymore. Um, some of you were asking me about what that symbol was on my hat that I wear sometimes. This symbol. This is the national emblem of Ukraine. It's called a trezub. It's basically translated to like three, three prongs. See, it kind of looks like a fork with the three, three prongs. Here's a, here's a bigger version of it so you can kind of see what it is. And so I bought this big cap somewhere online and took it to an embroidery place here in, uh, in my city and asked them to, to stitch it in. And so that's how I made myself a Ukraine hat. But unfortunately, the hat is still too small for me. And whenever I try to put it on, it immediately starts sliding back off. And it looks completely dumb on me. So even though I really want a hat that fits me, I still don't have one. <sighs> it's hard because during the summer, you want to you know, protect your head from the heat or, you know, protect your head from the strong wind, but it doesn't help at all. It just whoosh. 
So, um, yeah, so as I said recently, I've been getting a ton of messages on Facebook, on uh, Instagram, and stuff about asking me what type of rations have I not tried. And to tell you the truth, there are a lot of rations that I have not tried. If you're really interested, I will make a list in the description of all the rations that I would like to try that I have not tried. Um, but I'll tell you what, if you are interested in trying a ration, because believe me, some of these rations have genuinely interesting and delicious food. Uh, from my little experience that I have, I know that the um, uh, French rations have really good food. Really good food. I mean, stuff that I could not tell it was in a package in a meat tin if nobody had told me. Um, and yes, yeah, some other countries really kind of explode your mind with how good the quality of food is. And then there are some rations that you're like, yeah, that's kind of like what I imagined soldiers would be eating, just kind of whatever is left over in the kitchen. But, but I will leave a list in my description. But if you do want to try a ration, I would highly recommend that you go to mremountain.com and they also have an address at uh, mremountain.eu for the European Union. And uh, my man Casey is uh, uh, the owner of the, of the store and he is very happy to work with you. He will ship it wherever uh, you need it. Um, he's, he's a great guy. He's an honest guy. Uh, he does uh, good work. You can trust him. So yeah, give him, give him a, a visit on their website. I will have their link on, um, on my, in my description. I'm sorry. And then, uh, so those are for military rations. But if you're... For example, a prepper or a hiker or somebody who likes to go on weekend expeditions, for example, camping and fishing, and you don't want to, you know, spend hours deciding what kind of food to take with you. Do you want to take beef or do you want to take chicken? Do you want to take this or do you want to take that? Well, um, this uh, online store called the Minotaur Trading Company, it's owned by a, a, a gentleman by the nickname of Black Dog Bob, and he is awesome. His company makes custom meals ready to eat, or MREs, for the civilian world, and they are delicious. I've only had the pleasure of eating one, but my God, it was like, I couldn't believe that it was, like came out of a packet of food that you could potentially store for over a year somewhere and grab in case of an emergency. It's fantastic. And uh, Black Dog Bob does all kinds of promotions all the time. And he keeps thinking of new, uh, new ideas. He has a 72-hour survival kit. He has a 36-hour survival kit. He has all kinds of Arctic food rations and normal food rations. I would suggest you check out his website. Hey, maybe uh, buy something. Again, just live a little. Buy, buy one of these rations and see what what the internet is talking about that these rations have some really good unique food it may not be the gourmet food that you're used to when you go to your five-star michelin restaurants i'm not comparing it to one of those but 
damn good food at a damn good reasonable price. Especially if you're going camping or fishing with your kids on the weekend and you don't want to waste the time to to cut everything up and start and start a fire and mess mess up all kinds of plates. You just open up one of these MREs and everything is prepackaged. You just add a little hot water here or there, or uh, you use a flameless ration heater to heat something up, and you're good to go. And you have your main course, you have your snacks, you have your desserts, you have your drinks. It's fantastic. So yeah, I will leave both of those links in the description of this video. Um, but yeah, as I said, I don't have a camera anymore, which would allow me to really film reviews of MREs the way that I want to. It's a matter of monetary kind of uh, um, need is that I had to sell what I had because things had come up and and uh, yeah so um so I apologize I don't know if I'll ever have enough money to buy a camera again and that kind of equipment so but uh hey thanks for watching my short little video I wanted to show you my cat Katya but I think that she's sleeping somewhere which she usually does during the day anyways everyone Thanks so much for watching. I don't know why I did that, sorry. And uh, yeah, I'll see you uh, next time. Take care and uh, have a good week. Bye.